Hey there, Clueless Dad here. You may have just seen me installing my Panasonic TKAS41. I just wanted to do a quick addendum talking about the concept of alkaline ionized water. So this is a water purifier that also has an alkalizing function. And basically what that means is it changes the pH of the water that comes out of it. So for this one, I think it goes up to eight eight and a half and then nine and a half, something along those lines. And it actually also has a function for acidic water. So in this case, they actually tell you if you're using it to say wash your face, um, soap actually mixes better with acidic water. Uh, so if you have what's called hard water, which is basically water with dissolved minerals in it, uh, sometimes you have trouble getting a lather on the soap. So you may live in a place where the water out of your tap is naturally uh, either above seven or below seven. So in this case, having this device, having a machine where you can actually adjust the pH upwards or downwards from whatever's coming out of the tap is actually kind of useful. So the question is, why would you want to make your water alkaline or acidic? So for those who may have forgotten their basic chemistry, uh, let's give a quick review on what pH is. pH is a way to measure the acidity of a fluid, and it's a scale that goes from zero to 14. So 7.0 on a pH level is neutral. Uh, anything below seven is acidic, anything above is alkaline. So this device can basically change water from neutral to alkaline or down to acidic. And if you're washing your face, you actually wanna have water that's slightly acidic because it combines better with the soap and makes better lather. Uh, and there is a school of thought that water that is naturally alkaline is better for you. So if you have a lot of acidity inside your body and you combine it with alkaline water, supposedly that absorbs toxins and some other things. Or if you're an athlete who is training a lot and you have a lot of natural salts in your body, uh, drinking alkaline water will help you hydrate better. That's the theory. So in preparing for this video, I checked online, just I wanted to learn more about ionizers and alkaline water. Of all the research I looked at, there were some credible sources like the Mayo Clinic, etc., which said there was basically no conclusive evidence that alkaline water really made any significant difference, probably not too harmful, uh, but didn't really help. So the question is, if you were to spend you know, thousands of dollars on special machines that make alkaline water, are you getting ripped off or are you wasting your money? Luckily, this machine is only a couple hundred dollars, uh, and it actually is basically a water purifier that also has alkaline functions. So in my case, I don't really care about alkaline water all that much, especially since the main reason I bought it was for my baby, and babies, no matter what, are not supposed to be drinking alkaline water. They're supposed to stick with neutral water. Being a man of science myself, I always trust the data, and right now there's no data that conclusively says there's any reason to use alkaline water, so I'm not even gonna bother. I'm just gonna keep it on purified water. There is one good reason why you might want to have a device like this. If you live in a place where the water that comes out of the tap is not actually neutral, having the ability to either make the water more acidic or less acidic is actually somewhat useful. So even if you don't believe the BS about alkaline water being good for you, the fact that you can use this device to turn acidic water into acceptable neutral water, that's actually kind of useful too. So I don't mind having that ability even if I'm not planning on using it. And probably after I'm done with this video, I'm gonna actually do the pH test and see how it comes out. So I hope you don't mind my mini rant about alkaline water, but despite that, I'm pretty happy with my new water purifier that also happens to be able to adjust the pH of the water coming out of my tap. And that's exactly how I'm gonna use it. Do you have any feedback? Are you a big proponent of the health benefits of alkaline water? Do you have any peer-reviewed data which shows that it actually makes a statistically significant improvement on the health of a controlled population? If so, please leave a comment with a link. I'd love to read it. In which case, I'll totally reconsider and do a recant video. Uh, but until then, I'm going to keep it on neutral purified water. Okay, catch you next time. Please give this a video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And catch you next time on The Clueless Dad. Bye.